That's this guy. A hundred sins. Yeah, I'll pass. Also, there are no merchants, so I'm not sure if I can actually make money. Alright, let's look around. Uh, these guys are glowing for some reason. Ah, should have a look at that. Uh, so they are merchants. Weird. When I started the game, it said there are no merchants uh, in the game, so maybe you just can't buy stuff. A price embitterment. What the hell? These are like the guys in Mass Effect. What? Pardon? I want to see if that uh, leads to something. Probably not. Alright. Won't respond to us, so we need to speak to the other guy, I guess. First, let's see if I can... Uh... The indicators are kind of hard to get sometimes. I saw it twice, but now I can't... What? Can't seem to... get it again. Oh, there it is, and it's gone. There we go. Oh, it's from behind, that's why. Okay. Can you get out of the way? Thank you. The thief returned. Is he speaking about us, or about... Uh, Kalista or whatever her name is. I will call her Kalista because that's easier to remember. What was the Zina Kalisto? I don't remember. What enemy? Hmm. Had he come in same? So she's talking about us. If she's a C, I guess. Same ugly nose. Ten years ago, wow, what a memory. I want me some of that. Interesting. This is some really great writing here. <laughs> okay. Awesome. Let's speak to these guys. Or maybe not. He's a prophet. <laughs> and he wants money, right? Merchant. Let's see if we can buy. Yep, nope. 
Merchants don't actually work, indeed. Everything has been sold. <laughs> Alright, that's funny. A weird mechanic to not have ready. He's trolling me too. Buy weapons and armor, why don't you? The genocide, what? That guy seems serious, let's save. A blade that cannot cut, a weapon that cannot strike, living monument to failure. Okay. My arm is black in the earth and the skies. Okay, domination was my duty. All this. It was to have been mine in stewardship for the future of my people. It was promised, but now... Now I'm the genocide. A relict. The last of my kind. This is some good shit. Hmm. Rose against the superior foe. What for? You want to tell us? Hmm. Powerful nano saved him. Hmm. I wonder if that was the changing god. He imprisoned me in slow time, trapped me in my body, used my sins to paralyze my will. This is a level of writing I didn't expect from uh, In Exile. Which, I, as I said, I like the Westland too, but this is. Something different. Better. More. I must answer or suffer. Hmm. How did he stop you? He found all knowledge and made it his own. Build generators. We found the thing list of memory. Very nice. Let the memory come. Aha. This was with the woman and the giant with the axe that we killed in the memory when we first started the game. But apparently, it didn't happen exactly like that.
Pat gozda dzendzin godu. Yeah. You know now that the Nano who saved the city became the dzendzin god. You know it was he who defeated the Tabacht. You remember the hatred. The writing seems more on point. More than on point. Seems fucking awesome. Seems like torment. Actually, they did a f so far they have done a fantastic job by to capture the feeling of the first game. In everything so far. We'll see. Time is the ultimate weapon. This is fucking awesome. And this is interesting. I wonder if that means that he altered his mind or he gave him a, a different perspective on his actions. And then uh, the guy himself was shamed about his actions. This guy had okay, this guy is awesome. This is a random, <laughs> this is a random guy on Metal Street. Uh, that's crazy. He's probably not a random guy and he will matter because this is a lot of dialogue, a lot of uh, story. I think that's it. That was amazing. This is a sign dial. Uh, probably not. All right, we'll do another memory. We'll spend the points for easy. I wonder if I will gain a level. I seem to be gaining XP. I should be gaining levels too. I wonder if that's one of the sealed uh, generators this guy spoke of. That seems plausible. Yeah, it is torment. <laughs> I didn't expect uh, for it to be so good, actually. 
And I'm one of the people that actually loved Westland. Great job from In Exile so far. Yep. This device was used to generate a field that unmoored everything within it from time itself. I wonder if I can speak to him about this. Hmm. I didn't ask that. Or that. They are more the city in time, so yeah. They are the shield generators. So were they time travelers? Or because they were out of time, they couldn't get uh, supplies, maybe. That's always the case with time. We we'll always forget. One of them stands not far from here. Unlike the others, it still functions. It powers the clock around with us. Which those ridiculous full sprints. I need to look at that. I don't think it's that. Also, I'm wondering what the other spine was exactly. Welcome back, Verendi. I've spent like 30 minutes speaking to a guy. <laughs> yes, tell us more about the other spine. Our slave, our god, our prize. Kept us holy. Kept us pure and unchanging. Anchored to a fixed point in time, I guess he means. Mm, so that's why he messed with time to deal with them. What was the underspine? That's a good question. Machine. Stone Cavern City. Spoke to us. Interesting. Nope, I have more questions. <laughs> What's kinda cruel? To... Well, no kinda about it. It's cruel to do to someone who is forced to reply to you. But I still want to learn about them. Until the corruption of defeat. Nice. Alright, I think that's it. That is that goes extremely interesting. Alright. I need to find another one of those. Somewhere. That's not what I want. This is what I want. Hmm. 